Kia! Oh, it's enemy. Someone's under attack. No, I can't run to save him. My ore. My stamina. Use my ore. Spank the bastard. That's freaking right. Can I find more crickets? Every once in a while, I remember crickets exist, and I'm like, let's cut some grass. All right, are you okay? You can stop running. Is this your wagon? I ran away from Lurelin Village, just up the road. The whole place stinks of cut up bait and fish guts. Oh, poor guy. Is he vegan? Well, that's no life for me. I'm gonna make my living as a scavenger, fishing around Hyrule's rubble for neat stuff. Not much choice, really, since I uh, can't swim. Do anybody can learn how to swim? <laughs> Is it possible? Unless you have, a... I know like some people like are adults that don't ever learn how to swim, and I I, I still never understand that. I really don't. <laughs> Just because it takes like what like ten minutes to learn. It's not that hard. The best part about scavenging is you never know what kind of crazy stuff you'll find if you poke around for too long. Busted guardians, old ruins, it's all chock full of neat gizmos. You can sell for boku bucks. Boku bucks? Can we scavenge this thing? Ooh. Gotta make sure to scavenge just a little bit more, I guess. We'll just leave him to it. There's learning to swim and learning to not sink. I guess those are like two different skills. I have no clue where I'm going, but I guess that's the beauty of the game. It's also the beauty of not having the minimap turned on. I just wander around aimlessly until something good happens. I think this area down here is very tropical though, which means a lot of rain and rain in Breath of the Wild always sucks always hello dark shadow how you doing i like your little waviness that's cute oh that's another game i would love to do on wide toucan my like long form channel is i would love to play earthbound and mother three i've could i play mother three as like a series first because i've beaten earthbound before do people like need to know what happened in Earthbound to understand Mother 3? Or is it like a completely separate game that you can just play and enjoy without previous knowledge? Oh, there's like a random little tree over here. That looks pretty suspicious. And I'm still looking for the Sheikah Tower. It's like nowhere to be seen. How? How is it evading me for so freaking long? When Mother 3 eventually gets localized? Do you think it'll eventually get lo localized? What are the chances? At this point, I feel like if it's not, then it's not gonna happen. Well, that's not true. I guess it could always happen. Okay, let's see what's up with this tree. Ooh, there's two little statues. Do they both want apples? Or is one of them mad that he has an apple and he wants his apple taken away? Applesauce. Well, that was... <laughs> Some of these are just too easy. Even if it takes decades, it'll eventually happen. I mean, we already have a fan translation. Which is what I would play if I was to play Mother 3 on YouTube. I want to play it though because it's like a, a rhythm game, isn't it? And I'm good at rhythm games. Well, I thought that was going to be a bit more interesting, but it really wasn't. Where are we walking to now? We're almost up to the next region. We've walked really far through this region. Can I just fly down? I'm tired of walking. 
I need the hill to have a steeper slope. I found a cave? Is it dangerous? I don't see anything inside. I just run in. <laughs> Guns are blazing. All this water in here. Dude, it smells dank. I keep forgetting that shield surfing exists. Well, I don't forget that it exists, but I forget that you can do it on terrain other than snow. Like hillsides. Although I think shield surfing on grass breaks your shield faster, doesn't it? So it's not like healthy for your shields. Okay, this tree is exceptionally big. I must climb it and tell it I love it. I am a simple tree hugger, no more, no less. Lame ass bitch, 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 lame ass. Ooh, here we go, here we go. Up. Ah. Fat. Got him. Yeah. Not if they're Sheikah shields. Wait, Sheikah shields don't get hurt? From shield surfing? Yeah. I'm shocked. I'm floored. Oh, the guardian ones. The really bright blue ones. I didn't know that about the, the guardian shields. Some good knowledge. Yeah, any of these trees could be the Maku tree at this point. I'm pretty sure Zeltic once made a video that explained the the origin of all the names of the map, didn't he? I'm almost positive there's a video that like showcases what every single action, what every single section of the map was named after from like other Zelda games. I don't think every single section is named after other video games or Zelda games, but a lot of them are. I wanna watch that video again. It's really informational. <laughs> Could probably lead to me having some better commentary while playing this game as well. Now we've returned all the way back to Hatino Village and I only found one shrine while circling around this whole area. It's a little bit surprising, not gonna lie. I expected to find way more in this section. I just wanna find the Sheikah Tower though. Like that's what my mind is set on. I just wanna fill in the map a bit more. There's the Hatino Tower. That doesn't do much. I'm sure we'll see it once we get to the top of this mountain. This is gonna be a good vantage point. Of course, there's just bigger mountains in the distance. Whoa, that looks really cool from here. I don't see a Sheikah Tower in this whole entire area. What is happening? The game's gone mad. There's a lot of shrines on these dueling peaks. They kind of overdid it. This is a really beautiful looking pond slash oasis. Am I supposed to dive into the water there? I hope it's deep enough because that's what I'm gonna do. And if it's not deep enough, then I'll just get a concussion. But that'll be my fault. <laughs> I didn't measure the deepness. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff I have yet to do in this game. We're not even close, guys. Keep in mind that we're... I can't give you an exact percentage, but I'll have a percentage for you at the beginning of next play session of how far we are into the game. Did that really not count? I didn't land in the center. 
I do love cliff jumping though. That was one of my favorite things to do at the lakes in Missouri. There's a lot of good spots for cliff jumping from like really high spots too. My necklace is, it's a crystal. It's a tiger's eye. It's a stone to represent courage and charisma. I'm gonna jump from a little bit further back. Thank God that counted. It still wasn't very aligned, but it counted nonetheless. Bye bye. This water heals us too. Keith, don't ruin this moment. How dare you try to ruin my moment? I won't allow it. Why did I pick up the tree branch? I don't want that. Let's keep on walking on the mountain peaks. Oh, 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 wait. So I gotta throw the rock in there? Can I throw the rock in there? Or am I supposed to... Okay, let's see if I can make this happen. Seems like we have quite a few tries. One, two, three. Is that enough? I did not hit it enough times because my boomerang broke. What? This is doing a lot of damage. Okay, I hope that's enough. Whoa, that went way further. <laughs> I'm gonna try the Cryonis way. I'll just make all the platforms to begin with, I guess. Throw the ball, son. Don't be scared of it. You gotta be a man. Oh, well, if we're lucky enough. That's so dumb. They're, why are the rocks so bouncy? I already tried to jump down with the rock and it didn't work. I couldn't jump far enough. Oh, wrong button. Ah! Uh, two more tries. We're gonna make this work. I'm sorry. You guys are probably ripping your hair out. Probably ripping your dicks off right now. Oh, fuck. Okay. Aha. Told you it would work. On the very last rock. Ah! No! No! I somehow broke the block! Damn it! No, I... Oh my god. <laughs> I had so much pressure on me and fumbled. I fumbled. <laughs> that was the word. <laughs> and we're out of rocks. I guess I'm gonna have to come back to that one. Oh, I see something right here. I think this is an arrow shooting Korok. Uh, what? What am I looking for? I don't see anything. Oh, it's up there? We can try our best. Come on, refill, refill, refill. This is excruciating. How much time do I have left? Oh, I think we have enough time. Just like that? That was easy. Where was the challenge in that? Maybe the climbing bandana helped that much. Wait. Okay, don't lose my way. We're gonna get to the Sheikah Tower if it's the last thing I do. It actually might be the last thing I do today, once I get to that. We've been going for five and a half hours today. Nice, that's a decent amount of playtime. I'm happy with it. I said my goal was to 100% this game before Tears of the Kingdom comes out. It's so weird calling it Tears of the Kingdom during the stream instead of Breath of the Wild too. But it's also very refreshing at the same time.
What the heck? Why does Link have three shields wrapped around his belt? What is going on here? Is that part of his armor? What part of the armor is that? Is this how the Zora armor works? I get, yeah, that is just how the Zora armor works. Shoot. Oh no. That tower's for a different region. Where's the tower for this? Oh, there it is. It's right next to us. That's way closer than I expected. Oh wait, no, don't jump off yet. I wonder if I could climb up here. I think we can make it. Just go slowly. You go, Link. Look at you. Tom Holland don't know shit about climbing vertical surfaces. Use the real man. I saw Korok. Come here. Come here, my beautiful friend. No! Don't leave me! Ah. Just in time. Just in time for... Nothing, actually. <laughs> Where'd he go? There it is. Do I even have to climb it? Can I just fly to the top? That part of the armor that was around us is called Fault. F-A-U-D. That's an interesting name. Fault. Isn't it kind of crazy to think that almost everything in existence has a name or a word associated with it? Always trips me out when I think about that. And not only that. Almost every item in existence has a word associated with it in every language, too. Like, what in the world? How can there be so many sounds that people make with their mouths? We did it! We've been looking for like an hour, but we finally found it! Almost everything? I'm sure there's something out there that doesn't have a name. I'm not sure what, but something. <laughs> My, my YouTube channel, I guess, personal nouns. <laughs> I'm sure there's, I don't know. <laughs> I can't think of anything. <laughs> Hello, Shadow Prince. You made it at the perfect moment to scan the area. Yeah, some undiscovered animals deep in the sea. Flake has the right idea. Yeah, elements that haven't been found on other planets. Things out in outer space, you know. Oh, it feels so good filling in this section of the map. Woo! Do your nipples have names, Brando? I'm not sure if they do. If that's the case, then there's something else that is unnamed. Ooh, some hearty durians. Which version of Link would I date if I had to date one? Oh, probably Breath of the Wild. Breath of the Wild Link's definitely the most attractive. I think Breath of the Wild Link is the most attractive, because I like how he just has like kind of a, a very, what's the word? His body isn't too masculine or feminine. It's just like perfectly in the middle. He's in like perfectly good shape. He's well defined and toned. He has nice looking hair in this game. Apart from that, I think the only other option would be like Twilight Princess. After those two, I don't think Link is cute in any of the other games. It's really just those two. What is this? Do I gotta put something in here? Ocarina of Time Link isn't that? Yeah, he's not. I don't know if any of the Nintendo 64 models really cut it. I think I must have... Gotta leave some durians for the big statues, I guess. Wow, that's very specific. 
lily pad. Can I take my geraniums back? <laughs> Thank you. How do I get is this uh Stasis. Uncover whatever you're covering. Shoot. Just a radish. Just a radish inside. Can octo balloons pick up rocks that big and heavy? How do octo how do octo rock balloons even float? Where's the helium coming from? Unless they like naturally somehow have helium inside of them. Can I land on top of the palm trees? Oh, I wish I could stand on top of the leaves so bad. That's such a tease. Seems like you have so many like great platforms to stand on, like in Mario Sunshine, but nope. They just steal away the opportunity from you. Okay, I think this is a really good spot to end this episode in the middle of a jungle. I've been playing for five hours. I'm getting tired and hungry. So I'm going to have to say goodbye to all of my lovely hoes. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me and playing Breath of the Wild tonight. Or the, sorry, the prequel to Tears of the Kingdom. Got to make sure to get it right. And I hope to see you guys during the next play session. It's been a good one. Whew. My room is getting very hot as well, so it's time we head out. I can't get you off my mind. I think about you every night. Baby, I would love you right.